how about solving uh, other equations uh, transformable into quadratic equation? Like in this example, we have 3x minus square root of x equals 10. So, in here, we will let square root of x be equal to y or y equals square root of x. And then, uh, um, write 3 y squared, your x will become y. So, that's why it is 3y squared minus y equals 10. Okay, take note. We let y equals square root of x. Therefore, we will change the square root of x into y. That's why we write y here. Uh, where did we get uh, uh, squared here? Because this is automatic uh, is squared here. Because we assume that the value of y is equal to square root of x. That's why we write 3y squared minus y. Okay? And then copy 10 equals 10. Now, to solve this, we will transpose 10 on the other side. It will become negative 10. So, 3y squared minus y minus 10 equals 0. So, now the given is in a standard form. That's why we can perform by factoring or by quadratic formula. Okay, in here, I use by factoring. So, I multiply the first term to the last term. 3y squared minus 10 uh, times negative 10, rather. So, it is negative 30y squared. The factors of negative 30y squared that will give me negative 1 if I'm going to add is 5y and negative 6y. 5y times negative 6y is negative 30y squared. 5 plus negative 6 5y plus negative 6y is negative y. So, these are now the factors. Write the factors. Okay. So, copy the first term here, 3y squared. And then the uh, first factor, 5y. And then for the other factor, negative 6y. And then the last term, which is negative 10 equals 0. Okay. Now, get the common monomial factor. What is common in here is y. So, y, what is left inside? 3y plus 5. y times 3y is 3y squared. y times 5 is 5y. Okay, how about here? The common monomial factor of uh, 6, negative 6y and negative 10 is negative 2. Because negative 2 times 3y is negative 6y. Negative 2 times 5 is negative 10 equals 0. So, now, since we have 3y plus 5 and 3y plus 5, they are the same, we'll take it as 1. We just copy 3y, 1, 3y plus 5. And then, for the other factor, it is y and negative 2. So, y minus 2. Just combine them. Okay? And then, equate these factors with 0. So, y minus 2 equals 0. And then, 3y plus 5 equals 0. So, Transpose negative 2 on the other side, it will become positive 2. So, 0 plus 2 is 2. So, the value of y here is equal to 2. In the in here is uh, transpose negative uh, positive 5 on the other side, it will become negative 5. So, 0 minus 5 is negative 5. Since we have a value of uh, a here for y, we, have, uh, we will divide both sides by 3. Okay, to cancel out. So, what? is now the value of y after dividing both sides by 3 we have negative 5 over 3 now since uh, this is uh, the value of y here is 2 and then for the other one is negative 5 over 3 uh, we will solve for y equals square root of x to see if uh, these two factors are really the solution of the given equation okay so which one is a solution okay so let y equals square root of 6 as we write uh, on the, our first uh, solution okay and then we will substitute what is the value of y here that we get 2 that's why we write 2 and then copy square root of uh, x now interchange uh, just write the square root of x here and then on this side equals 2 okay and then we will square the 
uh, I mean, square both uh, sides. Square root of x and then 2. Okay, so v is square. That's why the exponent is 2. Why is it 1 half? Because square root of x is equal to x raised to 1 half. Okay, so 1 half times 2 is 2 over 2 or just cancel out 2, x raised to 1 is still x. So 2 squared is 4. That's why uh, the value of x here is 4. How about on the other side? So y equals negative 5 over 3. So we will see if this uh, solution is really the solution for the given equation. Okay, substitute. So first write y equals the square root of x. So, we will substitute. The value of y that we get is negative 5 over 3. Okay, interchange, it will become square root of x equals negative 5 over 3. In here, we will not uh, uh, square both sides. Why? Because uh, the principal root is negative. Where is the principal root? It is negative 5 over 3. So, here, if the principal root is negative, therefore, there is no solution. Or, this one is not a solution in the given equation. That's why the the only solution that we get is 4. How about if the given is x raised to 4 plus x squared minus 20 equals 0? So in here, another uh, equation that is transformable into quadratic equation. Now, we are going to get the solution. So, first, let y equals x squared since this is x squared, okay? And then, uh, all values of x squared will become y. So, in here, since this is 4, uh, this automatic squared. So, for x squared here, it is automatically y because we assume that y equals x squared. So, y squared plus y equals tw uh, minus 20 equals 0. Okay, the given now is in standard form. That's why we'll get the factor. I use by factoring. The factors of negative 20 are 5 and negative 4. 5 times negative 4, negative 20. 5 plus negative 4 is positive 1. So, 1y. Okay, now write the quantity of x plus 5 for the first factor. And then y minus 4 for the, for the second factor equals 0. Equate this with 0. So, y plus 5 equals 0 and then y minus 4 equals 0. Transpose positive 5 on the other side, it will become negative 5. So, 0 minus 5 is negative 5. Therefore, the value of y is negative 5. In here, transpose negative 4 on the other side, it will become positive 4. So, 0 plus 4 is 4. Therefore, the value of y here is positive 4. Now, we will see if these values are really the solution for this equation. Okay, first, uh, write y equals negative 5. And then, uh, the one that the equation that we assume, y equals x squared here. here y equals x squared and then uh, substitute the value of y that we get is negative 5 equals x squared okay now uh, interchange so x raised to 2 is equal to negative 5 okay get the square root uh, so that we can cancel out uh, the exponent 2 okay so it will become x here cancel out uh, x equals uh, negative uh, square root of negative 5 so the square root of negative 5 is uh, an irrational number therefore there uh, this is not uh, a solution okay how about x plus 4 how about x equals 4 so y write again uh, the equation that we assume y equals x squared and then substitute the value of y that we get is 4 4 equals x squared now interchange x squared equals 4 okay get the square or extract the square root so cancel out what is left x what is the square root of 4 positive negative 2 okay therefore we have values of x which are 2 and negative 2 now the solution is 2 and negative 2 for this given what if we have a given which is 3 x raised to negative 2 equals x raised to negative 1 minus 2 okay first assume that y equals x raised to negative 1 and then 
uh, write three y squared here equals uh, y minus two because we assume that uh, x raised to negative one is equal to y so we will write here y okay and then transpose y minus 1 on the other side to make it a standard form it will become 3y squared minus y plus 2 equals 0 now uh, by factoring perform by factoring to get the factors multiply the first term to the last term it it is 6y squared now think of factors of 6y squared that will give you negative y okay so in here there is no factor that will give me negative 1 or negative y if I'm going to add. And so, uh, I'm going to use by quadratic formula. Maybe I can get a factor using that method. Okay, let's see. So, since this is not the quadratic equation, identify the values of a, B, and C. The value of A is 3. The value of B is negative 1. The value of C is positive 2. Write the formula for the quadratic formula. Negative B, positive negative B square root of B squared minus 4AC all over 2A. And then substitute. After substitution, we have 1 plus positive negative B square root of 1 minus 24 all over 6. What is 1 minus 24? It is negative 23. So 1 positive negative B square root of negative 23 all over 6. Okay, in here, since we have an irrational number inside the radical sign, or negative number inside the radical sign, it, it becomes an irrational number. Therefore, we cannot get the factor here. Therefore, the solution here is none that's why we write no solution